I'm Klaus Lønge Christensen and in this short video I will show you how to make use of data exported from Odeon in programs such as Excel, uh, MATLAB or whatever. Even though Odeon doesn't have an exp Excel uh, export option, it is really very easy to make use of data from within Odeon in Microsoft Excel. Inside Odeon, uh, most displays, they will have uh, the option to do an ASCII output, that is to export data in a text format. This text format is tabulated, so it can be used very easily inside uh, Excel. Let's try and do that. So I will copy, I'll export this data using the Ctrl A shortcut, and Odeon will save this data to a file. Then it will offer you to open it in the Odeon ed editor, which you uh, should by all means do. Here you see the data, they are nicely uh, form formatted and, and they are formatted using uh, tabs in between the different uh, data. If we select this using the Ctrl A shortcut, then copy it using the Ctrl C shortcut, it's very easy to export it in a meaningful uh, way into Excel. I've opened Excel and uh, if I use the Ctrl V shortcut to paste data, you'll see that they end up very nicely uh, tabulated inside Excel. So you can make use of this DK curve, for example, uh, to, to create your own figures in, in whatever way you want to format the graphs. Also, if you want to compare different results from different uh, room simulations in different rooms, uh, for example, different concert halls or working rooms, uh, or you might to want to make calculations which are not possible in Odeon, then you can use this uh, export option. As I say, all uh, different displays, they, they will have the option to, to export data. So you can really make use of most of the data from win, uh, within Odeon uh, in your, your Excel spreadsheet. A particular useful uh, display is the uh, multipoint response. Uh, here Odeon will export data in different formats. So it's uh, so when you open the display here, you have uh, data organized from for different uh, receiver positions, or further down in the file you have statistics, or you have uh, the different parameters organized one by one already, so you can easily make statistics over uh, a particular parameter or display it whatever way you want to, to do it, to compare two different rooms, uh, etc. And this is really all there is to it. Uh, so thank you for watching this small video uh, on how to make use of data from Odeon within Excel and similar programs. Uh, I hope you find it useful.